All right, guys, welcome back. We are getting back into Banished. Let's see, how are things going? We are low on iron, we're low on logs, we're on low on firewood. It's been a couple of weeks. What a great way to come back to the game. So it looks like we gotta do some resource gathering. I don't want this just to be resource gathering, but at the same time, I'm kind of dependent on, oh my goodness, trying to just get things rolling with the sheep and with the other crops and hopefully getting some stone. We'll kind of see how this goes. Um, I think it'd also be nice to start to grow this town a little bit more. Every single one of these houses has people in it. In fact, this one has way too many. So we do need to grow the houses a little bit. Let's see. So if we were to expand, we don't want to come up here because that's where all the wood is. We don't want to go too far down because it's just pulling away from up here. If we were to open this road a little bit more, how's our stone? We have no stone. Awesome. That's just, that's great. Okay, so if we just expand this, I think this will be okay. So get that going. We don't need to worry about the gatherers. Obviously, we we'll want to get that up there, but it's going to take some time. Oh, I hate this. But our food is really low because of that last trade. That last trade, I will admit, was amazing. I guess our food's not low because of that. So our food is just low because it's low. Because it's only counting this and not what's in there. So I'm going to be less worried about the food for a little while. We'll just keep rolling along. But, gosh, we need that iron. We need the stone. And I would really like to start like destroying these trees as well. This might just be a let's get back on our feet kind of mission. So, if that's the case, let's speed things up a little. Because everything is running smoothly. I'm expecting people to die soon, which is not good because our laborers are at zero. So that's always a problem. But at least for now, people are happy. They're somewhat healthy. Gosh, we just have so much stuff that we could be building it's on pause the scariest one is this one I would really like to get houses up but we're a little bit stuck so now the food is all leaving we've got enough food in there for a while but we don't have enough firewood because people are using it we do have some logs gosh remember how I said that there's times where it's just like oh my goodness we're all gonna die kind of situation I feel like this is that kind of a moment. It's not, but it feels like that. All right, let's just cut this forest down right here. You guys need to be planting a lot quicker. I guess we did put a ton of wood in here and then use it all up, didn't we? Mm. Let's go ahead and put this back to 150. Because I don't want people freezing to death. Because that's what will happen. How are we doing on the heights? We're doing good on that. Oh, our tools are way low. We need to kick that back up into gear. For now, let's drop our uh, laborers or builders down to one and get the blacksmith in there. We've got the iron back, which is excellent. The Taylor is at capacity, so they're going to be doing other stuff, which is always very nice. I'm almost thinking we just need another forester down here. Because if we put another forester down here, then we can just destroy all of this, then let them build it out back up, and while that one's building up, this one's already done, and we can destroy this one. I really think that's what we need to do. So while that's going on, let's build more of a path down here. So we got that to extend. We're building all this up. Let's see. Where's my forester? There we go. Nope, not woodcutter. That seems best. 
So we'll need a little bit of stone, which we've got. Guess we still need logs, but that'll come with time. I almost feel like we should just cut this whole forest down right here. You know what? Let's get a little crazy. Let's just cut that whole forest down. You guys are making food, which is fine. I'm almost thinking if we get the food at capacity in here, I'm going to turn the one of the farms off so that's four people that can be doing something with the laboring. Because I don't want to keep taking away from the builders because the builders are going to need to eventually build this, which is going to take a little time. I'm going to need to build other things. So the beans are going, the cabbage is going. My pasture is just sitting there. Where are you crazy ships? And this weather is just ridiculous. More people being birthed. That's at capacity, that's good. That's at capacity, okay. So let's go ahead and do 300. 50. So he'll take away from there. They've had a chance to come grab their firewood if they wanted it. So you need to keep going. There's not a lot of logs to make more. I probably should have waited, but that's okay. It is summertime. That shouldn't be a problem. Alright, stuff's removed. We just need the logs and the stone. They are cutting down a lot of trees. That's good. They are bringing in the stone. Good, good. This is one of the things that I don't, whenever the stockpile is full, they take the stuff down, but then they transport it all the way back up to here with our uh, stockpiles, whereas they could just take it to the actual build site, which you just saw them do for a minute right there. So it's actually a smart way of going about it. We have all the stone here too, we could remove. Keep going guys, keep going crazy. That's still at capacity, that has no more iron again. Oh, no more wood. We'll get there. Late summer. Gosh, we're just gonna fly through a couple of seasons, aren't we? But there's no reason for you guys to sit here and be bored out of your mind because of this. I'm also still waiting for a ship to come in. There we go. There we go. Go crazy, guys. Go crazy. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going, builders. You've got this. As soon as this gets on, I'm going to put someone in there, and then I'm going to immediately turn it off. Cutting off. So let's drop that down to one. Hmm... So we're still putting food in there, so I'm hesitant to do that. Let's take one builder. Do that. Just got one, that's fine. Sure there is. There we go. We do have a lot of people come students. There's 15 people that are students right now as opposed to children. So that'll jump up the workforce, which will be great. Um, but the workforce will basically just be a matter of go grab that iron, go grab that those logs kind of thing. I don't want to rush that part of it too quickly. That being said, why have we not claimed any of this iron? Go snag all that, guys. We're doing great. In fact, I almost feel like that one builder, oh, and now we have one laborer, so they became an adult, they're a laborer. Let's add them back to the builders. Let's get a house going. Oh, um, I think it's that. And do just those two. That'll be good. Excellent. Why? All right. 
So this is sometimes something that happens where you got to make sure that this is set down so only one forester is going to be up there, one forester will be down here because they don't do that well. Ooh, 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 stop, stop, stop. We have a merchant. What have you brought us, young sir? <sighs> they will take food? Oh, sweet giggity. I want a walnut seed, and I will give you all of the beans. I will give you all of the cabbage. And I will give you some of the venison. Let's see. Hmm. I do recognize that this is going to kill our food supply because they're going to have to come and refill this. But for now, that's okay. So let's do 334. That puts us, I think, two over. And that's okay. We've got a walnut tree, guys. This is awesome. Now I can put people to go grow walnuts trees that we can get out there. The peppers I'm not really concerned about, but the walnuts will be great. Excellent. What can we order? I mean, it would be great to have some of that stuff. You guys have tools and wool, but... Gosh, I would I don't really want those things. I want animals. Can you bring us an animal? Alright. I like it. Let's dismiss you. At the same time, I don't want to lose all of our food. Because it is the middle of winter. So let's drop that down. Drop that down. Drop that down. Oh, that's so beautiful. I'm not going to build the tree now, but because we have it, where is it being stored? It's got to be stored somewhere. Or maybe it's just now something available. I'm not going to run it now, and the reason for that is is because um, the logs, I want to make sure get up. I want to make sure we're stable. I'm always about being stable, aren't I? But that's kind of what you have to do in these kind of survival games. How are we doing down here? Are you planting? I don't see any trees, dude. But we do have a crazy amount of logs. That's good. Firewood's going. We got this going. That's excellent. Beautiful. We got so many laborers. Holy smokes. Let's bump that back up. For the sake of it, I'm going to build this. Let's see. Where do we want to build an orchard? We have this here. Hmm. We could almost build an orchard right here. Let's see, where can we build it? Okay, so there's a house that's going to be built there. We could do that. I don't hate it. 13 by 8. Yeah, let's do that. Cool. So they're just going to have to clear out the trees. That'll be fine. They've got to obviously build that. More people born. I probably should go ahead and build this too. Since we have the resources now. Alright. We have little trees grown. That's good. We've got lots of trees up here grown. So, this is literally going to be how we go about this. There's lots of trees that are grown up here. So, chop them all down. This side's still young. We'll chop those down eventually. Then we will chop down all of these when they get regrown. Actually, we probably could just chop all those down below. 
Excellent. And while we're doing that, let's gather all the stone. Gather all the iron. Probably could have just done all of it, so that's okay. Beautiful. So we're in late spring, we're growing some more food. Our food reserves are low. Ugh. Why are they low? Holy smokes. Our health has actually dropped. How about we do this? Of course our food has dropped because now I need the food. Hmm. Sounds like I need another farm. Alright, we'll just do that so they can get the food. Tons of venison, go feed yourselves. We've got the tools, we've got the iron coat, or the hide coats. We've got the firewood. We'll eventually, ooh, let's stop this. We're not gonna get, oh, we had, we've had plums for a while. Let's do plums. We don't need it at eight. Oh, those are farmers total. So let's get two more to get more food. That should be good. I'd like to do another orchard now since I have had that. If I take this part, I could turn that into an orchard. Hmm. Yeah, let's do it. Oh yeah, let's go big. Let's go big or go home. Alright, so we'll create this. We'll add some more people to it. After this has been complete, we'll add some more farmers. So we'll still have the food, which is absolutely wonderful. In fact, I'm going to see how it plays out over here as far as having plums and walnuts, because I don't know what their cost is. And once we have those coming over here, we might actually just have this food for the storage barn. I don't know. I mean, we got tons of food coming in, so that's not a problem. We just got caught off guard. And I don't want to eat too much into this over here because that's my, or this is my space. And I've already cut into it here and here, so i got to be careful with that. But this isn't too bad right here. These already have, are almost full, holy smokes. Build another house. We'll turn this on. I mean, we have five laborers, so they're gonna help with that. I mean, look at all that removal right there, that's excellent. And it says it's at capacity. This one is at capacity, but then the one right beside is not. So that's all right. Let's go ahead and bump up the firewood again to 500. We've got a lot of food now, so that's great. We probably could up the venison again, because that stuff was, what, three each compared to the other food? So let's do, let's just go back to 2,000. Nobody gets venison right now. Awesome. Alright, so they just need to build that. They just need to remove the stuff there. That house is built and already has people in it. Jeez. Why is the health so low? Alright, it looks like we need a hospital now. So we've got an orchard. Let's not worry about working it, I just wanted to create it. Um, 
Got more farmer, so that'll be good when we get there. All that's been cut out. This will eventually be cut out, so that's good. We're doing good on logs, guys. We're actually doing really good, other than the health thing, which freaks me out a little bit. So I want to get this going. And they've already got almost all the resources. Just need a little bit more stone. And we'll get there. Come on, just a little bit more stone. You know what, guys? I'm going to leave it right here. As this is getting constructed, we need to get some health. We need to up that. We need to make sure that our food is always staying good. But these actually might be great trading points for the future to make some to get some more pasture. But we are actually doing really, really well. What do you guys think about this strategy of having another forester and literally just kind of raising the entire land just so that there's no more trees there anymore? Um, tell me what you guys think. We do have to get this going if we want to have that to be effective. So we'll have to turn this back on and we'll have to get someone in there. We're very quickly eating into our labors that we have. But tell me what you guys think. We just got a hospital right now. So we'll stop it here. We'll see how things go. And I will catch you guys next time.